<laughs> la chueca la cámara, ¿no? Sí, está un poquito chueca. I think the camera is a little bit crooked. Whatever, here we go. Hey guys, welcome to another episode. ¿Cómo están amigos? Bienvenidos. Today, we're gonna make five different pastas. I was gonna go for four, but let's stick to five. Why not, right? So, what I did, I cooked pasta. No salt, no oil, or anything. Each particular pasta is gonna have a different taste and different flavor. It's about a cup and a half. A cup and a half or two. <laughs> Just cook your pasta. Pick the pasta that you like the most. Cook it the way it's on the package. Or you can even use zucchini noodles or cucumber noodles. Up to you guys. Cook it. Get the small portion or a bigger portion. So let's get this recipe started, guys. I'm gonna show you how to make five different pastas. Here we go. Okay, so we're gonna keep this simple. I'll be using a blender for all the dressings. I'm gonna throw in a chile poblano. This is boil, so make sure to boil it. Because if you don't, if you use it raw, You're gonna regret it, but up to you guys. Then I'm gonna throw in like coconut milk, onion powder, salt and pepper, all the good stuff. You can always swap or remove or add whatever ingredient you like, and you can always find the ingredients written down below in the description box. So we're gonna blend the sauces or the first sauce, and then into a pan, I'm gonna add some oil. You can use whatever kind of oil you want, whatever you think is the best for you. Throw in the sauce, saute this for about three to four minutes, and you got yourself the first pasta. This is one of my favorite ones. This is easy and it's so good to make, and it's just like, it's so good. Guys. If you do give it a try, let me know if you like it. For our second pasta, I'll be using some sweet corn organic. I bought it frozen. It's not frozen anymore. I'm gonna throw in some coconut milk. You don't have to use coconut milk. I just like the texture and the flavor it gives it to the recipes. But you can go for almond milk or soy milk or cashew milk, whatever you have, whatever you can find, guys. I'm gonna follow the same process, throw in the pasta, add the sauce, saute it for about three to four minutes, and you got yourself the second pasta. You want me to be honest, this is my least favorite one because it's too sweet. I'm gonna garnish it with a little bit of broccoli. It's good, it's a good pasta, but I prefer like spicy, savory things. Numero tres, sesame oil, ginger, garlic, carrots, broccoli, cooked pasta, a little bit of tamari sauce or soy sauce or liquid aminos, whatever you guys use. And that's it, it's simple, it's so good. And it just like, I love this one. This is like my second favorite one. It's so easy to make, saute for three to four minutes and we're done for the third one. Numero cuatro, if you're into like strong flavors like herbs, basil, cilantro, parsley, all the things I mentioned, they're gonna be in this pasta. It's so good, it's like a lemony, herby kind of pasta. I love this, saute for about three to four minutes, add some lime juice or lemon juice. It's so easy guys, like I was like, I tried it and I'm like, seriously, this was so easy, but it's so good. Also one of my favorite ones. And last but not least, the spicy chipotle one. I'm gonna saute some onions, throw in our pasta, our cooked garbanzos, some chipotle powder, or you can even go for like actual chipotle pepper if you have it. Salt and pepper to taste, and that's it. So simple, so good, guys. This is the thing, I want you guys to be doing like simple stuff. Okay, guys, I'm done with the recipe for today. <laughs> Let me show you guys, this is the garbanzo one. Look at this. That smells really good. This is the chile poblano. This is the creamy corn one. This is the soy sauce one with like veggies. And last but not least, our herby, kind of like herbs, oily pasta. They're easy, they're simple to do, guys. Let's give them a try, okay? Mmm. Wow. This one tastes like one my mom used to make with like actual cream and cheese. This is really, really good. We're gonna try the garbanzo one. Yeah, I mean, they're all good because I made them according to my taste buds. <laughs> But this is really good too. The herb one, that's really, really good. Okay, let's try the creamy one. That's really good, but I feel like that will be one of those pastas where I get like tired of eating because it's too creamy. But if you like something sweet, this is perfect for you. And last but not least, the soy sauce one with the veggies. I tried this one already, it's really good. <laughs> this is really good, guys. Seriously, I cannot stop staring at my hair. Such a mess. Anyway, guys, this is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed today's recipe and the video. If you did enjoy the video, subscribe to the channel. If you tried them out, let me know which one you enjoyed the most or which one you like the most, and tag me on Instagram, follow us on Instagram. I love you guys so much, thanks for all the love and support.